Hello everybody, my name is Cash Hargett. This is my Roby PT-15 that I'm finishing up. A uh, quick shot of the interior. It looks a mess, I know, but it's more organized than you'd think. And we're gonna do a function check, make sure everything's working like it's supposed to. I'm gonna get everything inside here like I want it. Hang on just a second. she is, all buttoned up. The reason I got the lights so dim is we're going to do some function checks. So, make sure we got the bottom and the rudders. If you look down at the back, you can see the rudders. The rudders work like they're supposed to. Uh, wanted to play around with the lights. Let's see how the lights work. Oh, they light up good. Lights light up pretty good. And we got nav lights, got a mass light, got the aft light. Yeah, lights up the top part of that cabin pretty good too. So all the lights are working. Let's turn the lights back on so we can see what we're doing here. Oh, that was bright. Now, what's funny is we got depth guns. Let's see here. If you'll look, they're both, they're both mixed. But I hit this one switch. Let's do this. Turn that switch off, and only the forward guns work. The back, they're both in, independent now. Now I can do this. Swing this one over around that way, hit the mix again, and it tracks where that one went. Is that cool or what? So yeah, not a whole lot going on, just making sure everything works, making sure everything buttoned up. I need a little better, I'll get some more light in here real quick, get a little better picture of this thing. There we go. So, I've got an older Dynamite speed control in it. Uh, it's brushed. Don't have the prop on it, of course. You can tell how the shaft is sitting there. It's a X8R Free Sky receiver, Tyrannus transmitter. I'm using, um, let's see here, two mini servos to direct drive the guns. In the original instructions, it told you to set it up with uh, pulleys and this, that, and the other. Because most servos only drive 90 degrees, so if you put a big, ser a big pulley on one on the servo side and a small one on the gun, you can drive it 270. Uh, I thought this was simpler. I settled for 180 degrees. I think that works just fine. 270 degrees, I'd be shooting a guy off the, off the top of the cabin or something, so I don't want to do that. Um... Brush motor, two and a half ones. We've got the uh, Navy Compact gear drive stock in it. And uh, swapped out the motor that was actually wound for eight cells for one that's wound for six cells. And we're going to run two LiPos or six cells for power. So it's pretty well about done. I need to add a couple more details to it. Other than that, she's just about ready to splash. So. Hopefully, I don't know, maybe this weekend or next weekend, I'll have a video of her running in the water. So that's it. Just want to do a function check. The Roby PT-15, an old kit from the early 80s, and finished uh, at the very end of 2019. And 